Fortnite, today we are going to be making Devourer from Fortnite a Roblox account. The Devourer from Fortnite has been coming so famous lately, it's absolutely everywhere, and we're going to be making an exact replica on Roblox of the Devourer in Roblox. And it's going to be a lot of fun, and we're going to have a surprise later, so if you guys are ready for this, make sure to drop a like on the video, and if you guys are new to the channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button down below. Now, we are not going to waste any time today. We are just going to get straight up started on this Roblox account and just start creating Devourer from Fortnite. And I mean, look at my guy. He's super, super scary. He has claws. He has like a single Cyclops eye with a very crazy like double mouth. You guys see this? He has two sets of teeth. He has like the sharp teeth right here. Then he has another set of sharp teeth in the middle. All right. That's pretty crazy. When he eats food. All right. <laughs> It must be pretty difficult having like a small second mouth because technically the food would have to pass through the second mouth But he'd probably get caught up like in the first mouth right here and get stuck in his teeth So yeah, that's pretty crazy, but <laughs> He's just absolutely a monster an absolute crazy person So what we're gonna do is we kind of got to make like a bulky looking character All right, we got to kind of combine a few things here And I kind of want to do a few things like this the Magnabot for instance looks really really good because it has it, that gray sort of texture that he has uh, but the only thing I want to change here is actually the legs I want to I want to change the legs here and take them off so we're gonna go to left leg here we're also gonna go to right leg we're gonna take that off as well and we're gonna hope that we can get sort of like more regular legs more monster looking legs than the robot legs and then we're gonna go from there so now that we got that let's go ahead and start finding some of the items that are gonna go on the account all right, so we're going to try to look for a shirt. Now, there's a few different options that we can go for. Now, we got to find the Devourer shirt from Fortnite in Roblox. But if they don't have that, we can find some sort of scaly gray rock looking monster or greenish looking monster here for the shirt and pants so i'm not worried that that we shouldn't be able to find it because we should be able to find it but i'm going to type in devourer it is pretty famous so i i i wouldn't be surprised if someone has made it but we're looking around here we do get this one called the devourer but i don't know what this is dude this was made before the devourer was even a thing in fortnite so maybe we should type in devour fortnite and maybe we'll get a little bit of better results now <laughs> <laughs> this usually happens in Roblox. When you type in Fortnite and there's no results for the Devourer or the skin that you're looking for, it just gives you a bunch of other Fortnite skins that you're not looking for. So we're going to refine our search a little bit and try to find what looks the best. Now, it can be sometimes hard to find a monster type of shirts in Roblox, but I believe if we search hard enough, we should be able to find something. Now, again, we need to find something that's kind of scaly, kind of kind of has like that texture to it. Um, so I just have to keep refining my search until I find something. Thing that kind of fits what we're going for oh guys we found something i don't know what this is exactly but check this out we actually have something here that looks very very nice we have the shirt here and then we have the pants and it gives that sort of scaly sort of monster looking skin and this should look perfect with what we're going for so now that we have it we're gonna put the shirt and pants on the character we're gonna see how this looks like so far so we're gonna put on the shirt put on the pants now obviously we gotta customize the skin tone which we're gonna do here um i guess the skin tone of the grayness would probably be around here or so so let's keep refreshing until this loads now roblox is having a lot of issues today if you guys try to play pet simulator x you guys know that roblox broke once again yes the <laughs> Pet Simulator X update just keeps breaking Roblox. It's absolutely insane. So unless Roblox fixes its servers, we're going to have to go kind of blindly here. So it's a hashtag blind challenge. Put that in the comments. Hashtag blind challenge where when Roblox breaks and we have to make a Roblox account, we have to go based on our own brain and hope for the best that we get everything right. So I customized the skin tone. I put on the shirt and pants and I would have put on an animation package before I forget. So that way we can have a really, really cool animation package. Package. I want to put on the elder animation or you know what let's put on the werewolf animation because this guy's a monster He's absolutely crazy. This should look very very good in the catalog So pretty much now that we have the animation the shirt and pants and the skin tone customized We got to find this head here So we got to find some sort of monster head or accessory That's gonna have this crazy face with a cyclops eye, but that shouldn't be a problem here today So I'm gonna go ahead and go over here and go to accessories and let's type in cyclops here Let's see what pops up and see if there's any type of crazy one in there. There is a cyclops I and no way what is this bro what is this this looks insane dude dude I think we use this I wish it was more like gray but this might work good now I did see another image of my guy here of the devourer from Fortnite and he did have 
a green type of skin tone. It may just be this lighting that makes it look gray, but he does come in green as well. Now, do we use that? I don't know. We might make it, it you know what? I want to make it manually. I want all the colors to match because if the colors don't match, it's not going to look that well. So I think what we're going to do is we are going to get this Cyclops eye here. I wish we could try it on. I wish we could try it on to see how it is, but again, Roblox is kind of broken right now, so we're just going to kind of have to wing it. So, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to copy this accessory right here, and we got to kind of guess how this is going to be. So, to guess how this is going to be, we have the Angry Cyclops, uh, or the, just the Cyclops eye opened up here, and then we're going to go to body and go to face. Now, I do believe I already own the mouth for this, for the character that we want to go for. Um, so this shouldn't be an issue. And it looks like we don't need any, like, spike accessories. We could find some, but I do not think it's necessary. And we need some sort of crazy-looking smile like this. The creature's mouth. So, guys, since this is a hashtag blind challenge on Roblox, we need to hope for the best and pray that this is going to look nice. Because it might look crazy, <laughs> but it might look good. You never know. So to do this, we're going to go to the advanced section, and we're going to go ahead and copy the IDs of the Cyclops eye and the creature's mouth, and we're going to just press save, and what it's going to do is going to be able for us to combine two face accessories, and this should look pretty interesting. Again, I don't know how this is going to look. We got the shirt and pants. We got the robot claws as well. We got an animation package, which is the werewolf animation, and then we got the mouth and eye. So hopefully this looks good. Hopefully it looks great. We're going to go in game, and we're going to see how this is. So don't go anywhere, guys, because we're about to reveal this character. So if you guys are ready for this, make sure to drop a like on the video. And if you guys are new to the channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button down below. And without further ado, let's just go ahead and get right into it. All right, joining up in the Zeth Play Secret HQ, which is where I'm hanging out all the time and talking to fans. So we're joining up in the Zeth Play Secret HQ, which is, my, which is my own game, and we're about to reveal this character. Now, I'm hoping everything worked out. Again, we have no indication whether this worked out or not because it was broken. All right, Roblox is broken today. It does not give us a preview of how the account works. So we're just going to wing it. We're going to see how it looks like, and hopefully we did with the shirt and pants and the accessories and the animation package and the face and the eye hopefully everything worked together and it looks great i'm a little nervous i'm not gonna lie I, <laughs> i'm a little nervous how this looks like because we don't do many blind challenges but when roblox is down we have to do it we, there's no other way around it and yeah so we're about to reveal this you know what since we're like a crazy monster let's go ahead and climb up this volcano and we're about to show this off so guys once i reveal it make sure to let me know down in the comments how i did and as well let me know who i should make next down in the comments at the end of the video so make sure to rate it out of 10 uh yeah so drop a like subscribe let's go ahead and reveal it three two one and boom let's check out the back now the back looks good i'm liking the back now let's see the front let's see the front three two one in. oh wait it actually turned out better than i thought like if we had some maybe some head accessories with some spikes and stuff it would be more detailed but with the eye and the mouth it actually turned out really really well I'm very impressed how this turned out considering that we could not see how it looked like the entire time. Like, this is the first time I'm seeing it in game and in the avatar. Like, I think overall we did a great job. So, guys, let me know how I did down in the comments. Let me know who I should make next. Thank you guys so much for watching. And as always, have a nice day and I'll see you guys later. Peace.